hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video on today's video guys i'm going to teach you guys how to um upload your profile image on your um youtube channel but uploading the profile image um we have to go into we have to create our profile image so i assume you do not know how to create your profile image and just want to know how to do that and uh, guys if you want to do that um go ahead and type in canva.com this is actually um, what I use to create a lot of logo and a lot of um, profile. So type in canva.com and it's going to display right here. And then um, there are different things you can do with Canva. But before you start making use of Canva, make sure you are logged in to the Canva so that it saves every design that you have created on your Canva application. Now, if you have logged in, now let's go ahead and type in logo. Logo. Um, so it's going to show tech logos right there. It's going to show logos right there, but I actually want tech logos. So um, these are all the tech logo templates. So I'm going to click on that so that it's going to display all of the tech logo templates that they have created. So these are all the tech logo templates. And guys, you can also filter this search because um, let me do a quick explanation. Everywhere you see this pro icon, that means all of these are all pro made icon so if you are making use of them you have to actually purchase the pro version of um canva so if you want to make use of the free version um just scroll down to this filter area and select free but although it's still going to be showing you some paid version but do not worry just ignore that this is paid so do not use that so let's scroll and look for something free i'm going to pause this video while i look for that Alright guys, so after scrolling so much time, you can notice there are several um, the logos still. You can still keep scrolling and you'll be finding a lot of logos. But I think I'm going to actually settle for the one I saw up there. Um, this one right here. It doesn't look too sharp, but it looks too simple and very neat for me. So I'm going to be making use of that. But although I'm not very satisfied with this um, background color and also this test color, but this is something I can always re-edit or um, adjust later on. So let me go ahead and stick with this. So I'm going to um, double click on the name and type in Wonder. I'm going to type in Wonderwise. Right, so um, click outside and it has um, synced with the name and this is actually uh, how I'm going to leave the logo right now so um, to save the logo just come to this area and then um, download the image and it's going to take a while to download um, actually before I do that let me change this name to wonder why is logo so um, I'm going to click here and then hit download. So hit download once more and it will start downloading. So just about any logo you like, just choose any one you like, click on it, edit, and then um, start using it. So um, let me go ahead and go over to the YouTube channel. This is actually the YouTube channel that I want to edit. So when you open youtube.com, it's going to appear this way. So to um, edit the profile, just click on the logo icon on this right hand area click on that and then go over to your channel wait for it to load up you notice this is the logo we want to change so go ahead and click on the camera icon just right there staring at you um click on that and wait for it to load also um this might take a little while depending on how fast your internet is and it will load up so it loaded up and brought us to this area so just click on continue and then this is the logo so just click on upload and then wait for it to display the option. Go ahead and select where the logo was downloaded. I know where my logo was downloaded, it's under downloads. So I just have to click on download and this is the logo. If you can't find yours, just check desktop, check pictures and all those places. But I think you can find it wherever you have it. So this is mine actually. So let's scroll down and see if it fits in. If it doesn't fit in, you can actually move this around and you can also, um, increase it um to increase it and then zoom out but because my image is already fitting to the logo style so there is no need to increase and reduce so i think this is fine so i'm just going to go ahead and click on done and then the image is already displaying as my logo 
So just go ahead and close this out and go ahead and hit publish and it's going to be saved for us. So um, this is just what I want to show you guys on today's video. And you can notice the logo is already showing. So when you go back to the youtube.com, it's only um, it's going to be showing or displaying there already for you. But if it delays for some time, that is probably because your device is actually saving some cards. Do not worry, it's going to actually appear later on. But mine is already displayed right there which is all I want to show you guys on today's video. So I hope this video is helpful. If it is, please smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video. Guys, I will see you on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.